sure. Hi, so obviously this is not my YouTube channel. Uh, this is hers and her mom's and her sister's and just everyone's. I am going to be doing her makeup for this video because we didn't really have another topic. So, yes. It's not like professional makeup because she's doing it. Because I'm doing it, it's not professional. You're bad if you're not like a professional. I am like a professional. No, I mean like the makeup's not professional. Like it's mm -hmm. it's okay makeup, but it's it's not good. It's LA colors and be my beauty spot and um just a bunch of different brushes, which is fine, but like. I don't get makeup very frequent frequently. Okay, so yeah. And we're back. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to be doing is taking these two LA color palettes and <clears throat> seeing what I should do. Like the color scheme I should have. So we will get right back to you when I pick that. Okay, so now I know what I'm doing. So I'm using this purple schemed palette. So the first thing I'm doing is I'm taking this sparkly black and I'm just gonna blend that into her crease with this Ally Colors Pro Shadow Blender, which is what it's meant for, blending into the crease. Hmm? Don't you wanna get off so there's my turn? I know, well, because that's my next card. And it's like a little harder to do with her because she's like smaller eyelids, so. It, it looks horrible right now. I only blended a little. So I need to just stay still. And we will be back when we have that fixed. And we're back. So I blended black in the crease. So I, I like to make a disclaimer. I am very thoroughly good at makeup. Like I'm really good. But she tends to have very small eyelids. So it's a little difficult to do hers. Okay. So next what we're going to do is we're going to put a shadow in the middle of her eye to just set all the colors in together. And... This shadow will be, I'm going to use this rosy pink color right there. open. Sure. So, uh, this is what one eye looks like so far. Uh, yeah. Um, like I said, it's kind of hard, but we'll be back when the other one's done. So, we have the other eye done with that rosy pink color, and now I'm going to add a color into the middle and blend it out a little so it will blend with the other colors. And this, um, will be gold. It's this, that, I, <laughs> that gold right there. And it's really hard. I don't like this palette. Huh? Just saying. I don't, I'm not using it. It shows up a lot better. Okay, it's fine. Why is it in the middle? I said in the, uh, in the front, I'm going to blend out. Blend out from the tool to the Open. Show them. So that is the golden effect right there. Uh, so 
will come back when we have the other one done. So I have both eyes uh, complete. That's all I'm going to do to her eyes. Uh, but the rest of her face, there's still much to do. Not like much to do, I'm saying there's more makeup styles that we can add. So since we're done with her eyes, I'm just going to put that away and we are still going to need some of these brushes because she doesn't have a lot of brushes. So what I'm doing is taking, uh, she doesn't have any foundation or powder or anything. So I'm just going to take a concealer, pal a concealer palette and work with what I have. Sounds good. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to take the lightest shade right there and we're going to put that underneath her eyes. And I'm just going to make a triangle. Show them what it looks like. It's just a triangle of lightness under her eye because, you know. And I will get back to you when I'm done highlighting, illuminating this concealer. So I decided that I should illuminate above her eyebrow a little bit, so there's definitely some above her eyebrow. And, and I will also illuminate underneath her eyebrow later, but and that's when I'm doing the highlight, but for now. I need you to open your eyes. If you get something in my eye, I'm going to come in. Can I try to do makeup? Nope. Okay, next time you want to do your makeup, let me know. Okay. You can attempt to do my makeup if I don't like it. I don't mind if it comes off. Open. You realize we're still rolling? Mm hmm. Show them. It's all blended in. Yeah, it is. And look. So that side's obviously not blended, but this side is, and we'll be back when that side is blended. We are now done with the concealer palette. I'm sorry if you hear like a ton of noise. You know, again, we use the top one. If you have this palette, I don't think you would. Yeah, I don't know. And I will be right back. I'm back. Okay. So now we're just gonna go from where we left off. And, uh, I think you had makeup on underneath your eyes. <laughs> Ow, don't push super hard. <laughs> so calm down. It's fine. Okay, so now what we want to do. Highlight. And she doesn't have any highlights, so I have to use uh, this peachish color, though, um, in this palette, which is fine. Um, I guess it's a cute color. It'll work, so why not? cheekbones and up above the bridge your face don't move turn and I will get back to you when we have her other side of her face done so I'm going to use the same eyeshadow for more highlighter on her nose and above her lip and on her brow bone. We like highlight. <laughs> so I'm just going to... And since that brush doesn't seem to want to cooperate with your nose, I'm just going to get a fan brush in here and just... 
And then, of course, the fan brush for above the lip, which is great. There. Okay, never mind. I have to use this brush for you above your lip because it's not. Highlight is almost done. <laughs> so now with um, highlight, what we're going to be doing is taking this eyeshadow brush, which I don't use it as an eyeshadow brush anymore. She does. I don't. And I'm going to be highlighting her brow bone with. The same color. So I'm just gonna take the brush and get it in there. Brow bones are important. That's right, you don't need to suck no. in your face. It's right underneath your brow. <laughs> okay. And. Now. Yeah, these ones have like skin color too. It's not as good, yeah. Now, what I'm doing is... Eh. Put your own mascara on. Last thing I have to do is her lips. So, and I wanted to give her a vibrant color because she is very small lips so I want to get her like kind of like a vibrant color to set the mood in okay Okay, rub, but not too much. And you're done! And we're gonna get a better view of that. They're not completely even, but... Well, that's because your palette sucked! I mean, you you know where you can place them, though. I did place them. The highlight, though. The highlight's good, though. Everything's good. I'm a pro. Okay. Now, maybe after this, I'm going to attempt her makeup. Maybe. It's up to her. Okay. Bye!